What's going on everybody? Welcome to Cletus and Cars. We got Bernie here in the motion booth and we are ready to send this thing. I'm gonna put some new tires on them real quick, check out the tune-up, and then we're gonna get ready to send this thing in the burnout here in a little bit. They got some drag racing, some burnout action, and then we're gonna uh, rip this thing and knock some tires off the old S10 burnout truck. Last night's testing at the Freedom Factory was awesome. Uh, it was racking the nitrous, if you guys can hear it in that video, it's pretty crazy. But we're gonna get some new tires put on this thing, got some fresh ones. Uh, some old Douglas, so we're gonna get those thrown on real quick. Those are just some old trailer tires that I used for the practice over there at the Freedom Factory. So I want to start off with a brand new set, so we can put down the best burnout we can here and hopefully win this thing. So here is the burnout pit. So you'll do our tip in right here and into the pit. So it's pretty small. It's not a huge pit. Uh, so we gotta just try to go in, do a nice tip in, try to work each of the corners and see what happens here. So. Pretty excited here. We got all the fans, we got everybody here, but we're getting ready. Uh, I can't wait to send Bernie inside of this burnout pit with everybody around it here in a little bit. Just trying to get an idea of what my plan is for, you know, where we're gonna head with Bernie in that pit. Try to tr put on the best show that we can. What do you think? Waiting for some burnouts? Hey, you got that Clyde shirt on. I do. Woo! Nice. Warbird is absolutely insane. So this is Bernie goals in the future. Try to be able to do burnouts to compete with something like this. Uh, full send on the whole burnout deal and this thing. This thing is it. It's It's been a champion of burnouts before. Here's to look at things like the, the suspension and just some of the different things on this car because it's so crazy. And, uh, but if this can win championships over in Australia, then I, I can have something to shoot for, kind of look at. So crazy, you know, right hand drive, these seats are sick. All the tin work in it is super nice. Just, this thing is like a show car uh, that they just full send, which is so awesome. Fresh tires are on. Got a little bit of bald regal action here too on that uh, Band-Aid, so. Should be good to go. Drop it down. Well, handle comes out. Not the best. Missing that little pin. There we go. Nailed it. All right, guys. I'm gonna look at the tune-up here. Get that ready to go. And then we should be ready for this. Pretty, pretty nervous. Lots of people around. Like John Doc showed up with his methanol pro charge Colorado here. Just lots of crazy stuff, and I can't wait to be a part of it. This thing is going to be rowdy. You ready to rip this thing, dude, or what? I'm going to try. Oh. I have zero experience <laughs> with doing a burnout in a circle. And you brought a very rowdy vehicle to try it? As long as it blower surges, we're fine with it. Yeah, That's yeah. the only thing. So Hell yeah. I feel, I feel pretty good that I'm definitely going to hit something. <laughs> <laughs> Little rain delay. Good thing we had a box to... Uh, Keep Bernie all covered up. Florida things. Florida things, yes. This is a daily occurrence here when you become a Florida person. <laughs> Puddles of water and rain all day. Wet shirts. Wet shirts. It is looking good though. Yeah, it's perfect weather otherwise. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so it is raining they're still doing burnouts cool thing about a cletus and cars is you can still do burnouts even if it's raining uh but i'm getting ready to put the tune up in bernie thought about it some after watching that video last night of how it's coming on and off the nitrous to keep it above 6,000. i think i'm just gonna keep it on the bottle or off of it depending on how much throttle input i give it I'll also have the master override switch if needed or whatever uh so gonna set this all up put the bottle in get it ready to go we're actually in the burnout rivals at this conversation so we're gonna go be going against some of the best of the best here with burnout, so we gotta be on our A game. Gonna look at the tune-up right now, figure it out, and we're gonna head up there, get ready. Uh, I'm hoping that it drives out some before we get going with the burnout so we can get good tire smoke and everything like that. The rain, and it, it kind of makes it difficult. So uh, a lot of people in the pad right now, hopefully that kind of clears the pad out. Hopefully the rain will stop, dry out, and all that stuff, but it's just weather and what you gotta deal with. So let's get a tune-up put in this thing. All right, here we go. 95% on at 35 off at 67 with 7,500 rev limit. 
This way I can pretty much full send it. If I just roll off the throttle just a little bit to pitch the truck or whatever, it'll turn the bottle off. It'll start probably bogging it. But once I find my spot, roll back into it, grab the bottle again, and we'll be ripping right, right along again. So uh, this is the best tune-up. I've kind of sat here and pondered it for the last few minutes, trying to figure out exactly what I want, getting into my head, trying to feel the pedal and where the nitrous will cut off at. Like, it's just a feel thing. In this truck, you have to be quite a ways on it to be at full throttle. And then if you just roll off a little bit, it's like 95, and then you just kind of like get soft on the pedal, it's like 90. Um, so I put it at 95, so even if I get light in 87, it's not like clicking on and off the bottle. It, it's If I'm backed off of it, it's pretty much off. If I'm full, like put pressure on it, then it'll be on. And that gives me a good thing in my head whenever everything's going on that I kind of know where I'm at. And like I said, I got, I can disable, I can enable, I can grab the button. So whatever I think is the best is what we're gonna go try it. So I hope you guys enjoy this thing. The truck is all wiped down. They're still in the middle of the burnout comp here. Got the bottle in it. Just need to pull these uh, this tape off as long as it don't rain again. Kind of wiped it all down so then we don't have a bunch of water coming off this thing. I'm gonna add some more tires so we get the big pop when we blow them. Ripping it. <laughs> That's full, full tilt right there. <laughs> See, that's the problem with electric vehicles. I was so not excited. There's no noise to go with that. <laughs> that thing was a two-stroke. It sounded way better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Burnout Rivals competition. It started. We're going to get in the lanes with Bernie. Try to win this thing. Let's go. You ready to knock the tires off this thing, Andy? That's right. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Ready to do it. Ready to do it. Lots of rain today. Now it's time to... Time to get down. That night, we put on a show. That's it. Maybe you'll see some flames out of this unit, huh? Better. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I hit it pretty good one time, but I couldn't let out of it because the motor, I could feel it starting to go, and I'm like, if I let out, it ain't got enough power to get back in it. So I just had to keep it going. <laughs> <laughs> Made it count. I'm in charge of this? Okay, this does the throttle, right? Start two? What where's the start button? It'll be alright.
One more time, let's hear it for Bill Tudor Race. Come on. All right, listen, I'm not the judge. Again, I want to point that out. That's the first guy to tip in, blow both tires, not get stuck on the wall, and his car is still running. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good, man. That's pretty good. Hey, nice job, dude. Hell yeah. We blew both tires, still running. The only car to do that so far at this event. So what a killer burnout that was. It did exactly what I wanted it to do. Uh, it was a little hard to control in the pit. It didn't steer as quite as well as I'd liked it to, but uh, it, it, Bernie freaking crushed it. What a what an insane burnout by Bernie. Ready for another one. Plays 500 bucks. Jason Yoder in the 1981 Chevy C10. So for burnout rivals. And I don't know what else he said, but you know, well, like, perfectly yeah, sideways. It was so awesome. Sick. Yeah, he did. just came in right. It was yeah. so sick. I just gotta hope How for do that you even w. notice the wall? Yeah, just gotta hope for that W. Hey guys, here's the deal. Shut her down for one second. For the burnout rivals, in third place, we have Justin Keith and his F body Camaro. We have the Motion Race Works Bald Regal. Woo! We have James yeah! and the Belcher Race the Burnout Truck. Let's go! Let's go! All right, cool guys. So James is gonna pop the tires on white trash, and then it is time to run some jet Guys, we won Burnout Rivals. I can't even believe it. Bernie crushed it right here in this pad at Cletus and Cars, Florida. I just, we entered into the Burnout Rivals deal and we ended up winning it. Did exactly what Bernie was designed to do. And I, I can't even explain how excited I am with that. Just another win for Bernie, popping tires. Like Cletus said, came rolling in here, did a good tip in, touched the wall, did a wall tap, blew both tires, left the truck running, drove it back to the pit. Just, insane bernie killed it everything works so amazing so thank you guys so much for following this thing i hope you're enjoying the burnout content we actually just dropped a new do a bernie shirt uh, i'll put it somewhere here on the screen for you guys to check it out if you like it hopefully you do uh, i'll put a link in the description you guys can pick one up if you want but again guys thank you so much i hope you enjoyed this and we're ready for another burnout contest all right guys we'll see you in the next video hit that like subscribe and share button see you next time